Hey, having a mission statement as a financial advisor is extremely important. It helps to align you with the people that you want to serve. It tells your story. And most importantly, probably number one is it makes you stand out from other advisors. Now in this video, we're going to actually listen in on an interview with a financial advisor that found his passion through a tragic incident in his life. And this actually came to us by surprise because we were hosting a public virtual event and this advisor came on and just shared this story that uh, I'll be honest with you, it had uh, almost everybody in tears. It had other financial advisors in tears as he was sharing his mission statement. So unfortunately we couldn't get his face, so it's gonna be audio, but you're gonna see us kind of reacting to this mission statement that he shared. And I hope that it inspires you to create your own. All right, let's take a look. Hey there, Hi, Doug. Doug. Hey, Doug. Okay. Well, for starters, I just want to thank Carmen and Darius for giving us this information and sharing it with us because uh, I want to tell you, I have worked and worked and worked to get into this business. And it's easy for me to understand the information about products. I've spent 60 years as a CPA. And so the product knowledge is a piece of cake. What this business is all about is getting in front of people. Yep. Mm -hmm. And I did not know how to do that. Mm -hmm. and you have solved that problem for me. And I signed up as quick as I had the opportunity. And my thanks to Jeremiah. Jeremiah, you may not know this, but I've had long conversations with your mother. And uh, she and I are good friends. And, um, and I know your wife, and, and I'm so impressed by her. And I, I want to tell you, Tim Steinberg is on your staff, and he started out as a caddy, as did I, at the age of 10. And wow. I would not have a college education if it weren't for a 17-year-old black kid who taught me how to caddy. Amazing. Man, I want to I want to I want to have a, a tea, coffee or beer with you, whatever you drink. I, I want to sit down and have a sounds like you got a lot of great stories, Doug. Yeah. yeah. So anyway, wisdom. six years ago, I told a doctor who walked into my hospital room who said, Mr. Davis, we're going to discharge you as quickly as possible. It was before daylight. He turned on the light and woke me up unexpectedly. He said, what you've got is the worst form of cancer I have ever encountered. I said, well, doctor, I want to tell you something. You look really handsome in that white jacket, but it was my creator that determined the moment of my birth, and it will be my creator that determines the moment of my death and not some good looking guy in a white jacket. <laughs> I had three other doctors tell me that. Here I am six years later when I completed that chemotherapy, $500,000 of Medicare later, I thought about what do I want to, how do I want to spend the rest of my life? And I want to help people get out of debt and retire on tax-free income they can never outlive. And now, Carmen and Darius, you have given me the platform that I can do that on. You got us all emotional over here. <laughs> it took me four years after the chemotherapy to get to the point where I could barely walk. Mm. And now here I am a year later and I am raring to go thanks to Carmen and Car Car Carmen and Darius and Jeremiah. Well, y'all better watch uh, out. YouTube's not ready for you, Doug. This yeah, is amazing. The, the, I mean, as soon as your channel is live, you tell us in the members area, we're all going to subscribe. So make sure you tell us that story in your videos, Doug, because yes. you're going to reach people that the Brits will never reach. I'm mm -hmm. never going to reach. Your mm -hmm. story is, is special. It's unique. 
Um, it, it's beautiful. Thank you for who you are. We love you, Doug, and we love everything you stand for. Wow, right? <laughs> Anyways, that was, that was extremely touching. And if you're looking to create a mission statement as a financial advisor, let me give you three tips. Number one, try to link it to a personal event. You know, so many advisors today are shy to share what their passions are or what their vision is. And, you know, you could have a passion about really anything. You could be a patriot. You could be someone who's very religious. You could be somebody uh, who has a, a cause that you believe in, like dogs. Maybe you can hear some dogs barking in the background because my neighbor has some dogs. Um, maybe you could be passionate about something like that. These are all actually... Uh, different mission statements that real life financial advisors have used in order to attract their tribe. The second thing you want to do is build it into a statement, a power statement that people can remember. For example, you could be passionate about the business community. I help business owners to protect their wealth and get their tax to zero. Right? So for example, that could be a mission statement. That's really simple. It's something you can use on your Facebook page, on your LinkedIn page, and so forth. And number three, make sure that you're using it everywhere. It should be in your email subject lines. You can put it, instead of just putting financial advisor on your LinkedIn profile, you could actually have that as your mission statement. And I'll tell you, that really helps you stand out from other advisors. You can have it on your Facebook page. You can have it on your business cards. You should have it on your website. All right, so those are three quick tips inspired by the man, the myth, the legend, Doug Davis himself. If, you, if we missed anything or you've got a mission statement you'd like to share with the community, go ahead and leave it in the comments below. Or if you have some questions or are struggling through this, go ahead, leave us a comment. I'd love to help you out as well. Don't forget to check out the other videos. We have videos around getting appointments, generating leads, email marketing, webinar marketing, virtual marketing, virtual meeting tips, anything you need as an insurance or financial advisor to grow your practice. All right, thanks for checking out this video, guys. Don't forget to hit subscribe if you got value. Smash that bell so you'll never miss an update from advisors. Thanks, everyone. We'll see you out there.